We're at Oasis Charity here in Cobham, which is a really amazing charity which helps lots of families in the area. Hello. Hello. Oh, nice to meet you. Nice Caroline to meet you. Thank you. Thank you so much for coming. No it's such problem. a pleasure to see you. Thank you. We used to live in Cobham when Virginia was at Chelsea, and I got involved with the local Christmas hampers that they were doing. From that, I got more interested in this charity and the work that they do. What's your name? Jorginho. <laughs> When I realised that there was so much poverty in the area, it was quite shocking. So um, that was the kind of main motivation to get involved with them. What's your name? Catherine. Cat. Easy, yeah? Easy. <laughs> What's your name? Ronnie. 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 Let me show you outside, because a lot of our children, they don't have garden facilities, so it's really important for them to have outdoor play. Enjoy. Thank you. <laughs> Enjoy. This is lovely for them. It has the space. We can do lots of outdoor activities. They are it's learning lovely. about really how lovely. food is grown, because we want them to have healthy diets. We need to introduce healthy living because of so many families struggling with food poverty. I mean, every day we're hearing from parents who are saying, I have to make a choice tonight. Am I going to feed my children or am I going to put the heating on? Yeah, I can recognize all the situation from like where I come from as well, you know. Many times I asked my mom for something and she'd cry mm. because she'd say, I, I, I can't, don't have the I money. Can't, I'm so sorry. Mm. And something like the chocolate or something. The yeah. chocolate yeah. or the yogurt, yeah. you know, yeah. and she couldn't do it. Yeah. And yeah. if she did, I wouldn't have the, the pasta for dinner, yeah. let's say. Yeah. Virginia was born in Brazil. Growing up, he didn't have any money. His mum worked really, really hard and had to stay away a lot. He was looked after by his sister. So I think it really kind of feels quite close to home, like hearing these, these stories that Caroline has told us about. Now my position, my situation is different. I, I just can't forget where I come from. That's not me. That's such a, that's such a wonderful thing to hear. It surprises us that you don't get any funding or anything like that, and you, it's all from like fundraising yourself. It's all from the goodness of the, of the community. How can you not have more help? That's it's, the question. Well, yeah. Yes. Well, that's why I honestly I am so blessed that you've both come today. It, it feels good to help. Hey. <laughs> A lot of this stuff they they said today just reminded me of my childhood in Brazil, and that's why. It felt a bit... Uh, like it hit deep. Yeah, 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 it did to me. Yummy. Ronnie, what's in your sandwich? What's... Chocolate. Chocolate. <laughs> so much for our healthy diet. <laughs> Ooh, looks good. Someone loves chocolate, huh? Jay is super passionate about helping people. His background is quite difficult in some ways, like coming from that to where he is now. Like, that's... I think, yeah. <laughs> and the, the life that our children have. Because of that, he's like, amazing. <laughs> Sorry. What is this, Maya? <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>